The name of our play today is Anansi and the Strange Moss-Covered Rock. Once upon a time, Anansi, the spider, was walking, walking, walking through the forest when something caught his eye. It was a strange moss-covered rock. How interesting. Isn't this a strange moss-covered rock? Everything went black. Down fell Anansi, senseless. An hour later, Anansi woke up. His head was spinning, and he wondered what had happened. I was walking along the path, and then something caught my eye. I stopped, I looked, and I said, isn't this a strange moss-covered rock? Down fell Anansi again. But this time, when he woke up an hour later, he knew what was happening. Aha! This is a magic rock. And when anybody says the magic word, isn't this a strange... <laughs> Down he goes! This is a good thing to know. <laughs> so... Anase went walking, walking, walking through the forest until he Alice. came to Lion's house. Lion was sitting on his porch. At his feet was a great yam. Anase loved yams, but he was too lazy to dig them up himself. So he said to Lion, Hello, Lion. Isn't it a hot day today? Yes, it is. I'm going for a walk in the cold forest. Would you like to come? I would. So, Lion and Anansi went walking, walking, walking through the forest. After a while, Anansi led Lion to a <clears throat> certain place. Hey, Lion, look. Do you see what I see? Yes. Isn't this a strange mouse-covered rock? Down fell Lion, and Anansi ran back to Lion's house and made off with his yam. An hour later... Lion woke up. His head was spinning. He looked around, but Anase was nowhere in sight. And when he got home, he found that his yam was gone. He was very sad. But Anase was very happy, and he couldn't wait to play his trick again. Once more, Anase went walking, walking, walking through the forest, and this time he stopped at Elephant's house. Elephant was sitting on his porch. At his feet was a huge banana. Anase just loved bananas, but he was far too lazy to pick them himself. So he said to Elephant, Hello, Elephant. Isn't it a hot day today? Yes, it is. It's beautiful. I'm going to walk the cool forest for you like to come. So, Anansi and Elephant went walking, walking, walking through the forest. And after a while, Anansi led him to a certain place. Hey, Elephant, look, do you see what I see? Yes, isn't this a strange moss covered rock? Down fell Elephant, and Anansi ran back to Elephant's house and made off with his banana. An hour later, Elephant woke up, and his head was spinning. He looked around for Anansi, but Anansi was nowhere in sight. So he went home and found that his banana was gone. He was very sad. But not Anansi. He was really happy, and he couldn't wait to play his trick again. So he went walking through the forest until he came to Rhinoceros' house. Rhinoceros had a huge jar of coffee beans sitting on her porch. Anase just loved to drink coffee, but he was too lazy to pick and roast them himself. So he said to Rhinoceros, Hello, Rhino. Isn't it a hot day today? Yeah. I'm going for a lot of food. Would you like to come? Yes. Yes, I will. So... Anase and Rhinoceros walked through the forest until Anase led her to a certain place. Hey, Rhino, look. Do you see what I see? Yes. Is it Mr. Strange? Well, how are you all? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
down fell rhinoceros. Anate ran to her house and stole all her coffee beans. An hour later, rhinoceros woke up and her head was just spinning. She looked around for Anate, but he was nowhere in sight. So she went home and she found that her coffee beans were missing. She was very sad, but Anate was really happy and he couldn't wait to play his evil trick again. So he went walking through the forest until he came to Hippopotamus's house. Hippopotamus had a beautiful pepper. Anase loved peppers, but he didn't like to pick them himself. So he said to Hippopotamus, So they went walking, walking, walking through the cool forest until Anase led him to a certain place. Hey, Hippo, look. Do you see what I see? Yes, isn't this a strange moss covered rock? Down fell Hippopotamus, and Nase ran to his house and made off with his pepper. An hour later, Hippopotamus woke up, and his head was just spinning. Anase was nowhere in sight. So he went home, only to find that his pepper was gone. He was very sad. But Anase was very happy, and he couldn't wait to play his trick again. So he went walking through the forest until he came to Giraffe's house. Giraffe had a beautiful orange. Anase loved orange juice, but he couldn't pick those oranges himself. So he said to Giraffe, Hello, Giraffe. Isn't it a hot day today? So they went for a walk in the nice cool forest, and Anase led Giraffe to a certain place. Hey, Giraffe, look, do you see what I see? Yes, isn't it a strange moss covered rock? Down fell Giraffe, and Anase ran to his house and made off with his orange. An hour later, Giraffe woke up and his head was spinning. He looked all around for Anansi, but he was just nowhere in sight, so he went back home. And he found that his orange was gone. He was very unhappy.